Here's your word for the day from Calvary in Lake Havasu. Visit us on the web at calvaryaz.com. Good morning. My name is Jesse. I am the worship pastor at Calvary, and I will be sharing your word for the day. Today we are in Matthew 5, 5, continuing in the Beatitudes, where Jesus is teaching the Sermon on the Mount. So Matthew 5, 5, it says, Blessed are the meek, for they shall inherit the earth. That is a great promise. Meekness isn't weakness. It is strength under control. When we are meek, we submit and conform to God's will. True meekness means freedom. Freedom from hatred and vengeance. It's humility. A meek person could be described as someone who suffers wrong without bitterness or a desire for revenge. As a follower of Jesus, the Spirit of God lives in us so we can rely on His strength. Here are some ways that we can live towards meekness. Being humble and willing to submit our life to God in all areas. Having compassion, humility towards others, forgiving, being patient, gentle, and trusting God fully. We can ask God to fill us with His desires, His will, and to give us a meek heart and a humble attitude. Another step could be inviting someone you trust to speak into your life who will be willing to speak truth and love and help with accountability according to God's word. A willingness to be transparent and invite accountability brings freedom and growth. There's peace and joy knowing God is in control and that he will reward his followers in the kingdom of heaven. So live out your faith and obedience to God with a joyful, humble, teachable spirit. Trust God and rely on his strength as we live out meekness daily. Thank you for joining us today and may the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace in believing so that by the power of the Holy Spirit, you may abound in hope. Have a great day.